And I want to bring your attention to the accomplishments of one of the most successful high school coaches in Hampton Roads history, Leo Anthony, one of my favorites over the past 30-some years. In fact, one of his former players, Chris Reckling, takes a look at his colorful and impressive career. While the object in golf is to post a low number, first Colonial golf coach Leo Anthony recently reached a very high number. Anthony reached 1,000 wins as a coach, 589 in golf, 411 in basketball. But it means a lot to me. I, I, uh, and I, I never knew that they combined golf with, uh, with, with basketball. I just kept doing it. And then I guess the Virginia High School League keeps track of that stuff. Anthony's success coaching both basketball and golf was spread over two schools. He got his start at Princess Anne High School. In 1972, Anthony decided to start coaching golf. His first team included future PGA players Allen and Curtis Strange. Since Curtis and Allen were in my PE class, I thought it would be a good idea for me to coach golf. His team won the state title that year, his first of three, and he still wears the championship rings today. You know, if you get the good kids, and I always seem to have, have good kids, great kids to play, and that's why I'm in it so long. Prior to his coaching career, Anthony was a two-sport star at Old Dominion, shortstop in baseball, and shooting guard in basketball. A member of the ODU Hall of Fame, Anthony is the first Monarch player to have his number retired. They always ask, could, could I play today in, in the way the basketball is today? I, I've always prided myself in, in shooting. Longtime Princess Anne golf coach Hutch Hammond says Anthony is coaching for all the right reasons. He really has a kid's, uh, you know, their interest at heart because you couldn't be doing this. I've been doing it for 31 years and he's been doing it a lot longer than I have. And I know if he's been doing it that long, he's got to just love what he's doing. In Virginia Beach, Chris Reckling for the Sports Wrap.